Hello everybody, this is the Hamptons Butcher, and today we're going to be going over how to pick out a, a cooked ham. In front of me I have three different hams. One is the same, but uh, two different pieces, and then the other is a, a glazed ham, or a spiral ham as most places refer it to. So the one on the left, it says Smithfield hams. This one is a butt half smoked ham, and what that means is it's just from the butt half that connects to the the loin of the uh, pig and it's smoked it's not really sometimes they season it smoke it with like a like a hardwood smoke or that's the flavor you pretty much get from it it's nothing sweet or anything it's just a nice cooked ham and usually i would say for i mean both these hams here that's a shank and that's a butt and with those i'd say it's about half a pound to a pound per person because the bone does have a lot of weight so I'd go more towards a pound per person when trying to figure out how much you need to buy for your uh, guests and your family this holiday and people tend to go to the butt more because maybe it's a little smaller and they're not feeding as much people but they say it tastes better but I say they're the same it's just like the actual leg cut in half this is the shank half of a whole smoked ham and uh, it usually has a, a long bone running through it, and people will use this bone for like pea soup. And uh, you can use both bones for pea soup, that really doesn't matter with a smoked ham. But uh, shank is a little bigger in size, so I'd say an average size is close to like 10 pounds, 8 to 10 pounds. And um, it's the same thing, about a half a pound, pound per person you use to judge. I always go a little more per pound, so this way you're safe, and um, they're usually a little cheaper, and uh, they're great. Like, I've never had a bad ham, and usually they're great the next day with eggs. So, and below this one here is a smoked ham, I mean a spiral ham, and usually that's the ham that has the, the nice glaze to it. As you can see here, it's a hickory smoked with natural juices, but it also comes with a, a bag with brown sugar, so it's brown sugar seasoning and spiral hams there they're really good they're sweet uh, everybody tends to pick these up more than the other ones especially during the holiday usually these two are more popular when it's like out of holiday season but spiral hams usually popular during Christmas Easter even Thanksgiving like I, if uh, I've had one before at Thanksgiving so and these, this one is a shank. You can always tell a shank by like the little point in the back. Like this here is that little point, and then this here is the butt. And you can see it's kind of looks like a butt, but it's a, uh, it's not. But uh, is it a little closer? All right. So, like, and it's the same thing. About seven pounds. I mean, seven to ten pounds on a shank. And uh, you're not going to really notice the difference between a spiral, uh, sm uh, the difference in flavor between a butt and a shank with a spiral ham because you're putting all the seasoning on it and if you're going to pick one out, you're going to pick it for size and how much you need for your family. It's the same thing, I'd say about a half a pound to a pound per person and usually they, like I said, between 7 to 10 pounds on these so, you know, you could easily feed 14 people with one one of the one of each of these hams so if uh, you liked my content please head over to my website www.thehamptonsbutcher.com and if you have any questions comment below and I'll be there to help you all right as always thanks and please subscribe also thank you bye